Hi everyone, it's MJ from my paper journey. And yes, I'm back again with another quick share. Um, I got this package from Cindy T. Um, that's her YouTube channel. And on Etsy, her store name is The Other Paper Girl. And I know I didn't order anything from her recently. So she sent, I got this. So I thought I'd go ahead and turn the uh, camera on and share it, share it with you as I open this. And Cindy, really you didn't need to send me anything, honey, because, well, if it's just to thank me for the little shout out I did, it was my pleasure to do it. I didn't do it for any other reason only to help another fellow crafter and me being an, um, an ex Etsy seller um, I know that um, well we need all the help we can get and if I could help uh, send someone down to your store and or subscribe to your YouTube channel I was just happy to do so and I already see some cutie stuff here. Oh my goodness. Cindy, you're too, too kind. What do we have here? What do we have here? It says thank you. Oh my gosh. I, I bought these vintage cards from her. But I haven't, you know, embellished them or anything like that. You guys ought to go to her channel. She has a lot of awesome, very creative ideas and very shabby chic. And it's so, so beautiful, all the stuff that she makes. This is absolutely stunning. Wow. Oh, I just love lace. Doesn't lace make everything so much better? <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at it. And then she embellished the side here. And then she put all the pretty embroidered um, applique flowers. And um, how cute. It says, Dear MJ, thank you so much for your friendship. Shout out last Friday. It was such an unexpected blessing. I am sending you a few little things to show you my appreciation. I hope they will bless you in this small way. May God bless you and your family real good. Hugs and kisses, Cindy. Proverbs 3, 5, and 6. Is that your favorite uh, Bible verse, Cindy? Because that is my favorite Bible verse. Lean not on your own understanding and all okay. Lean not on your own understanding and all your ways acknowledge him, meaning God, and he will direct your path. And that is my favorite Bible verse. So I hope that is yours too. So we have that in common as well. Gorgeous, Cindy. Thank you. I love this card. I have another thing to put up there. <clears throat> Not that I have a lot of room. Oh, let me see. What did she send? And then she has it embellished on the back with some um, layered um, fabric and some lace. Very nice. These are so pretty. And then she does a lot of this. You know, Cindy lo loves making all these. Uh, dolls and and then she'll embellish the uh, the dress forms with little this is so pretty I love these flowers do you have these in your shop so cute beautiful 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 oh, she sent me a teddy bear oh and some seam binding in blue and pink and a piece of um, French lace with some sequins on it and a, an applique embroidered um, flower there. 
isn't she cute and she does them double guys she does them um, both ways I mean if you turn it on the front and you turn it in the back you have the same image and she uses a nice sturdy um, chipboard though she did mention she's changing uh, what she uses and she's not using the chipboard she's using something else but it's still uh, sturdy um, enough and she's doing that so it kind of saves you um, so it won't be so expensive and pass the savings along to you guys I hope I was staying in frame because you know how bad I am. Oh, look at the kitty cat, and I love kitties. Look at this French uh, lace, the little flowers. Look at, oh my gosh, so cute. I love this lace. I just ordered some lace similar to that, but it won't get here until I don't know when. Look at it. Let me see, can I take it out? So you guys can see. All the cuteness stuff that she has in her store which and so wrapped so nicely I just undid it it's a postcard and is a um, um, ribbon a thick those a wide uh, ribbon holder which is perfect or you can wrap like you know thin ones here and another one on the right hand side this is so cute. Now I even miss up all that prettiness that she had this wrap so nice. Cindy, honestly, you didn't need to send me anything. I really appreciate you doing this. But I just did the shout out because I believe in helping out other fellow crafters. Just like Dale, she helped me. And so she blessed me. So, um... I want to bless others so that's how it works you get blessed you blessed others and those others will bless others well see you turn around and you bless me with this but honestly God knows my heart I did not do this for any reward I didn't expect anything in return oh my gosh thinking of you oh so cute <laughs> look at your lid she used the lace and she made it into a bonnet isn't that cute and then she put a pink button there and a little satin rosette oh, and it's a little journal and she did a little pocket here and it's a can you take this out yeah i think there you go oh and then she stamped like a teacup I don't know if you can see it. Is this coffee stain? I just wonder what kind of... Um, did you use like a, a wax or something on top? That looks really uh, vintage -y. I like that effect. Hello, beautiful. Oh. So pretty. It's a journaling card. And it's a little mini... Uh, little booklets I can journal on jot down my ideas guys you should see I have like three or four journals going and whichever one I find that's where I write my idea and then it's hard for me to remember where I wrote it down because I write them down on different ones yeah that's just the way I roll so cute well thank you so much Cindy thank you I really really appreciate this so um, I also wanted to just give you an update, um, everyone, on my charms. What did I call them? Hand, hand slow stitch uh, charms that I shared with you. Um, was it yesterday? I don't remember when I posted this. And then this is the one that I did um, on the um, with you how I how you know my little my process nothing it was nothing complicated or anything however Susan from um, down under gave me an idea that maybe I um, should put a perfume or something inside and then so I made this one and I wrote and I put the word friend and I did put perfume my favorite perfume which is Marc Jacobs Daisy, I love that perfume. And then I put a sewed on a paper, 
a paper a small paper clip because it's not a big um, it's not that wide and then um, then I put that uh, little rosette embroidered rosette and I did slow stitch but because I used the same color thread you really can't uh, see it I don't know if you can if you can see some of the stitching but everything was hand stitched nothing was glued other than the word friend <clears throat> Excuse me. And then I, I also made um, this other one. So you can maybe this one you can see a little bit more of the hand stitching. There we go. And I put the word hope, and then I sewed uh, another paper clip in the back. And then I made this other one, and I put be kind. And I don't know, you can see some of that white stitch in there. But it was all uh, slow stitched. The only thing that was um, glued on was was the word be kind. Now this other idea that Susan gave me was to do like a flower, dry flower. So I created this one. This I did not uh, hand sew. I didn't slow stitch. Um, everything was uh, glued. So that's what I did, and some of my pressed flowers, and I use, um, what I did, I covered, I used a, a piece of, just a scrap of file folder, and then I covered it up with a very thin, um, kind of like on a um, satin fabric, and very thin, because see, you can still see the, um, the uh, manila folder color in the background. And then I glued on the flowers, and then I got a uh, lace. I don't. I think I put away the lace that I use for this. But similar to this, something that it's see-through that you can. Um, you can see through that. And so that's what I did. Um, here's the on the back of the lace. I just fold it over and uh, glued it, and I put a. This is the only large paper clip that I found that I found so this this one is going downwards instead of to the left or to the right. But yeah. So that was Susan from Australia. That was her idea, her suggestion. And so I said, "Oh, that's a great idea." So I tried it and I did this one. Now I want to make another one, but uh, a lot of my pressed flowers that I have, they're kind of, you know, large. They're big. So I have to go through and find some other little ones like I, like I used in this one. Okay, that's it. I don't want to take more of your time. Again, um, Cindy, thank you. You're very kind. And that's it, guys. Have a wonderful weekend. It is Friday again. Another video. Sorry. Putting up with me. Another video. Like, shut up, MJ. <laughs> But no, yeah, thank you. Have a great weekend again, guys, and um, I'll see you on my next video. God bless.